So before we start talking about the different kinds of maps today, I want to take a moment to help us kind of get an idea of where we are on the map and where we are in relation to our school and our block and our neighborhood and our, our county of Manhattan and our city of New York City and then eventually of our state, New York State. But let's start small. Here is Dos Puentes Elementary School. <laughs> it is a six minute drive from my home. Um, here is PS 132, right? We shared the building with them and you can see the outline of the building on the map, right? Uh, right here we have 183rd Street and 182nd Street, Wadsworth Avenue and St. Nicholas Avenue. So those are the streets that we're bordered by. And you can also see some symbols. There's a symbol for a traffic light, right? There's a traffic light at each of these intersections. There's a symbol for food, a little knife and fork, where you can find Burger Heights delivery. There's a little shopping bag for places that you can shop, like this video game store. Um, the schools have a little hat, like a graduation hat. The only reason Dos Puentes doesn't have one of those is because I marked it on the map with a big red dot so we can keep track of it as we zoom out, okay? Which we're gonna start to do. We're gonna zoom out a little bit from our um, block. Whoa, zoomed out very quickly into more of our neighborhood. So now we start to see a few more things, like we see Broadway going up and down here. We see Bennett Park, which is a park that's very nearby to us. We see over here the beginnings of the Harlem River, and over here the Hudson River, which you can actually see the Hudson River is a lot wider, right, than the Harlem River. And we can start to see some neighborhoods. So we're in this neighborhood called Hudson Heights. Right to the north of us, there's a neighborhood called Fort George. And right to the south of us is a neighborhood called Washington Heights. And a lot of times we think of this whole area as Washington Heights, right? So one important thing to think about is that people are kind of always deciding and redeciding where things are, right? People named these places and they can change. So if we keep zooming out, we see the top, tippy tippy top of Manhattan here. And you see that um, there's the beginning of um, why we're an island. Miss Pena was talking to you guys on Tuesday about how an island is land that is completely surrounded by water. So we can see the Hudson River coming in here, turning into the Harlem River and totally surrounding that tippy top of Manhattan. This is actually a bridge right here. So continuing to zoom out, oh, they gave us a little flash of Fort Tryon Park. Let's recenter ourselves. So you can see Dos Puentes stays right here at the top of Manhattan, but the rest of Manhattan starts to come into view. All right, here we go. We're gonna keep zooming out. And there is our island of Manhattan, completely surrounded by water, okay? And if we continue to zoom out, we can also see the Bronx to the north of us, Queens, there's Queens, Brooklyn, and right over here, oh, hard to see, gotta keep coming out, Staten Island. So those are the boroughs of New York City. Staten Island, Brooklyn, Queens, Manhattan, and the Bronx. Here it is. It's hidden by Dos Puentes Elementary School, right? It looks like it's under us, but it's really not. It's above Manhattan. If we zoom in for a second again, we can see that. Well, it's above and, and to the east of us, right? All in here is the Bronx. There's the Bronx Zoo for some of you. I'm sure that is uh, a place that you know. Okay, so I wanted to show you that if we continue zooming out, we will eventually see all of New York State. 
And we are actually at the bottom of New York State. It includes this Long Island, right? But this is actually New Jersey over here. So let's keep zooming out, whoa, quite a bit. There's Dos Puentes getting smaller, right? And we're gonna continue to zoom out. You see the Hudson River keeps coming all the way up New York State. And here, if we zoom out even more, it's the state of New York. It's a very large state with New York City kind of sitting right at the bottom of it, okay? So we're gonna be doing some work with physical maps of New York State today. And I wanted to just show you where we are in relation to those maps. So let's zoom back in again. Here's all of New York State. Let's zoom back in one more time. Go home, right? New York City starts to come into view. The boroughs of New York start to come into view. Staten Island, Brooklyn, Queens, the Bronx. Manhattan, our island of Manhattan starts to come into view. Oh, don't lose those puentes. Our neighborhoods start to come into view. Fort George, Hudson Heights, Washington Heights. And then here we are back home at <clears throat> Dos Puentes. Okay, guys. So we're gonna talk a little bit about some physical maps of New York State today, and I just wanted you to see where we are in relationship to that very large state.